Hello everybody, it's your boy Prashoff and we're back again with another shoe on head video. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Seriously now. Oh, oh. This is a... Uh, it's called watching awful BuzzFeed tier videos you sent me. Okay, so we're gonna be cringing to some BuzzFeed shit. Okay, let's do it. Okay, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I prepared my soul. <laughs> oh, by the way, this video is like two years old, so... It's okay. Oh, would you put a goodie? Well, hello again. Whatever the thing is. Loving fucks. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Happy 2018. Jesus. Happy. Well, she turned into Russia all of a sudden. God it's damn. It's here in hell because we all died in 2012. But that's a uh, video for another day. There's a lot Don't of worry. <laughs> a lot of people. Seriousness. A lot of people are gonna die in 2020. So. Red and terrible things happening in the world. Oh, right now. Even my YouTube feed is just full of serious boring things that give me anxiety. So I think we need some good old fashioned cringe and laughs. So throughout the years you guys have sent me hundreds upon hundreds of video requests, which I have ignored. Because there are just some videos that aren't worth a full response. But today, I thought we would go through those videos, so I'm going to turn this into a drinking game. I got some rum here. Every oh, she's actually drinking. If they mention the wage gap. So she's gonna be reacting to a BuzzFeed video and every time they she's gonna take a shot if they mention the wage gap, pink what the fuck is pink tax? Out of context for rape stat, if they mention privilege, if they mention cultural appropriation, if they mention man manning mm, self hating white people if they state what year it is, if they mention Trump. She's gonna die. She's actually fucking gonna die. I mean, we know she makes newer videos, so she's not dead after this somehow. I have to drink. They mention God damn. Tax, I drink. If God damn. If context rape stat, I drink. My hair is fucked up today. I drink. If there's a self-hating white person in the video, I drink. Now, June fact number 812, I hate alcohol. I never drink it, I gag, hey, I die. Same. I can't do that. You can gag on something else. I'm a major... Sorry, major, sorry, 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 sorry. Tweez, tweez, tweez. Low falling fluid. Oh, it smells of death. Oh my god, I'm gonna. Uh, 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 uh. First video. Let's go. This video was so <laughs> bad that MTV deleted it twice. I present to you. Ha, okay. How do they delete a video twice? What? Wouldn't it mean that they uploaded it after they deleted it? By the way, what the fuck's up with my fucking hair? Jesus Christ, pissing the fuck up. God's mistake, the video. Hey, fellow white guys. <laughs> oh no. Self hating white. Mistake, the video. Hey, fellow white guys. <laughs> oh, no. Hello, Self buddy. White guy. Here we go. The fuck is that shit? Is he doing a magic trick? Hello, fellow Wait, why white guys. What did she do? What? Why is she plugging her nose up? It's weird. Hello, fellow white guys. I'm just like you. I too enjoy golf and shooting up my local high school. I am definitely not a giant crab in human skin. It's about to be a new year. And oh. there's a few things we think God you can A giant crab in human skin. It's about to be Yo, my boy got some cheeks. Be a new year. And there's a few things we think you could do a little bit better in 2017. Let's catch it. And here's what you can do in 2018. Don't. Can we all just agree that Black Lives Matter isn't the opposite of All Lives Matter? The opposite of Black Lives Matter is Black Lives Don't Matter. Stop bragging about being woke. I'm sorry, is that Matt McGorry? Stop bragging about what? Black Lives Don't Matter. Stop bragging about being woke. I'm sorry. Oh, woke, woke, okay. Is that Matt McGorry? What? Is that the wokest bay of 2015 telling us to stop saying woke? No, I know that's not Matt McGorry, but... All these doughy, self-hating white guys just look the same to me. I'm sorry. Am I racist? Learn what mansplaining is, and then stop doing it. Oh, god damn it! I'm going to... Learn what mansplaining is, and then stop doing it. Oh, god damn it! I'm going to die! <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, oh, in 2014, I would have made an entire video dedicated to mansplaining. Because back then, I wasn't used to this bullshittery. Three years of this, I have been calloused. I am now numb. It's just like part of my balanced breakfast now. Eggs, balanced milk, breakfast. toast, pain. I'm done, sorry. I'm done with this man. Pain. Man shit. Next, 
Okay, okay, okay. What is that bitch doing? Oh, an entire video about. Oh, Wait, shit. what? Women try man spreading for a week. Okay, who in the, who here is man spreading? Is he is that is what my boy over there is doing? Considered man spreading. He's not affecting anyone. And I mean, he's not even spreading his legs. That, what the? Buzzfeed. Come oh, an on. Video. Come on, Buzzfeed. Oh, shit. An entire video about man God spreading. damn, she's gonna get wasted. Thanks, guys. That's my first train trip oh, as a man spreader. I just feel like a monster. Man spreader. Oh, really? How can you do this every day without being what the conscious fuck? of it? My favorite part of this yeah, is so cool, so. easily when I got to sit next to men who were taking up way too much space and just forcefully work my way into the seat. Forcefully work your way into a seat. What's wrong? Oi. The seat and without words. So basically, they just sit with their legs. So they're assholes. That's the video. They're Next. assholes. So with the help of artist Sarah Levy, we're taking period shame and flipping it on its head. It's ladylike, and today we are painting with our menstrual blood. Why are you? Jesus Christ. What is wrong with these people? They're painting with their menstrual blood. Should I stop painting with my cum? I mean, I'm afraid of pressing the space key. Doing this to me? What have I ever done to you? My name is Sarah Levy. I gained notoriety for my portrait of Blanca. Uh, Trump. Oh, Trump. fuck. You know, when you're taking a bath and you're on your period and then you like have a little clot, you just get those like long membrane strings of blood. Kind of like. Well, I don't want to know this shit, bitch. I don't want to know any of this shit. Cheese. Stop, 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 uh, stop, 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 stop. I'm not even grossed out by periods. I don't think periods Stop are a shameful thing, but when you start describing in great detail your clots and your membrane cheese, you can miss me on that shit. Next, please. A 24 question black people have for white people. Oh shit, I'm white. Oh okay. my god, I just had like PTSD flashback. That was some like MK Ultra shit. Just put that royalty free Buzzfeed jingle on and I just fly into a fit of fury. Why is it that white crime is seen as an isolated incident, but black crime is a representation? Okay, listen, I cannot answer any of these questions. I, I live in Bulgaria. In Bulgaria, you have like two black people probably. I've seen three black people in Bulgaria in my life. One in my town, one when I was in the capital, and one when I was in a town close to here. In uh, my, yeah, in upwards of 20 years living on in Bulgaria, I've seen three black people here. And I've only been in America for like 12, 12, around 15 months total, so I can't really answer this like, shit. Uh, Steven here popped 12 Xanax before coming to the BuzzFeed studio. Oof. I honestly don't blame you. When we see a story on TV about a white serial killer, I don't automatically assume that all white people must be serial killers too. Good, that means you're a normal. So if you see a black serial killer, you assume all black people are serial killers? The fuck? Oh, rational thinking person. What? Why do you feel like having one black friend makes you a cultural expert or not a racist? Is your only black friend comfortable with being the reason why you can't be racist? By that logic, then I'm not racist. I have a ton of white friends. Well, so you're saying without that logic, you are racist? Well, yeah, I don't expect a racist what? person to be friends with people of the other fuck races. Is... <sighs> How come you can't pronounce black names like Kuban Janae? But can say names like Schwarzenegger, Gallif I cannot pronounce what? Galifianakis and Wait. above. Because those people are famous. But can say names like. How come you can't pronounce black names like Kovanjane? Kovanjane. But can say names like Schwarzenegger, Galifianakis, and above. Because those people are famous, and we constantly hear True. their names. Are you serious? 
Excuse me, sir, in this video that was made a year ago, are you serious? Please answer me. Why is it so hard for you to acknowledge your privilege? Uh. <laughs> Why do you kiss your dog on the mouth? Okay. Hey, white people, stop stereotyping black people. Why do you kiss your dog on the mouth? I don't. I understand well, some people do it. It's not a big deal. I mean, it's kind of a big deal because the dog licks its ass, but I mean, the dog is like, it's your, it's, it's, the dog is like your best friend in animal form. Okay. It's there for you. Bitch. Obviously you don't have a dog. It's something special. By the way, why do you fuck dogs? Listen up. Oh no. You're still not equal pay for equal work anywhere in the world. <laughs> hey, she's getting just like I like more woman. Wasted. From now on, I love my boss. Kick. What the fuck is this bitch doing? Because Your choke slammed this hole off the table. Do some fucking WWE shit. Tombstone her off the table. The fuck you doing? Oh, my boy looks like, hey, I'm working here, Karen. Need more. Our haircuts are more expensive. True. Our underwear is ridiculously more expensive. Hey, listen, bitch, no one's making you wear any of that lacy shit, okay? Where's all my fucking uh one dollar pants and sh what are they called in English? I don't fucking know. If you have fat ass, I don't give a fuck what kind of underwear you're wearing, okay? So I mean, you to buy your haircuts, true, true. They're expensive. Yeah, yeah, you can you can still do what we do, okay? You can go with like a bald head, having like no hair. It's okay, you can do it. No, no, you choose to be more expensive, bitch. Oh, the pink tag. I did a video oh, last Oh, that's year. the pink tags. Okay, 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 okay. Time flies when you do nothing. I did a video last year about the pink tax. It's basically the conspiracy that women get... Fuck. The conspiracy that women are paying more for things than men. I'll put the link to the video down there. Watch it. It's really funny. Not me, but the whole, like, concept. This guy is drunk already. Right? You get paid less than someone who applies body lotion to his face. No. And you don't. You also basically just... What? Okay, okay, okay. Let's ignore the whole how much you get, how much your life is, how expensive your life is. You don't get paid based on what you spent your money on. You get paid based on your work and your quality of work and what your job is. You don't get paid based on how expensive your haircut is, what kind of body or where you apply your body lotion. I'm pretty sure your boss doesn't care if you fucking pour body lotion down your asshole, bitch. The fuck is wrong with you? Summed up why women pay more for things than men? Because men give less fucks and are fucking stupid. They will literally use body wash as shampoo, body lotion as face lotion. I could use this hand cream on my face, but instead I pay like $50 for my face cream because it's great and it works. So I spend more money, Real but I shit. win in the end. Capitalism. <laughs> I think it would have been so much better if we saw some women getting choke slammed. I never thought I would say that in my life, but so spend here we are. Money, buy our <coughs> shoes, assault men. Next. Have a shot this. Or this. Nothing like a good reaction gift. No. But you've probably noticed the most popular ones are of black people being dramatic. This. Is digital blackface. Oh, no. oh what? <laughs> I forgot about this video. No! This is the video where they dead ass say it's racist to use gifts of black people. Blackface is when a non Yeah, if you listen to these people talk about black people, it almost sounds like they're an endangered species. Like they're uh they're like uh what's a fucking endangered species currently? Uh, I don't fucking you know. Like some endangered animal that should be kept in a zoo far away and uh, you know given like three meals a day so they can repopulate and what the fuck how pathetic do you people do you think people are this is kind of like if i was bad I'd be pissed as fuck like they basically think you are pathetic as fuck that you can't do shit for yourself that you need to be protected by everything and anything that's fucking that's fucked up yeah, that's <laughs> jesus christ oh i heard about it like I, the fucking 
uh, Warner Bros. and all those old shows were crazy racist, but I mean, America was racist a lot during that time, so it's kind of understandable now. Oof. Oof. Ass game, they ass kicked. White people using gifts. Yeah, but those are actually like real life black people being expressive and funny. They're not white people dressed up like black people. How is this comparable at all? This is some like weird ass internet meme segregation or something. What even is this? If you're white, you are only allowed to use gifts of white people? What? Get out of my house. Let's talk about white people using dark skinned emojis. This is a form of cultural appropriation. What is happening? Uh, <laughs> the emojis are fucking culture. <laughs> what the it's fuck? Like, this is like a sketch somebody would make if they were making fun of SJWs. How is this real? The Lord hath bringeth a banquet to my sides. Next. I'm a feminist. Say what? Oh no, she didn't. Mari L just used the F word. Oh man, I've never wanted to kick a child more in my fucking life. Look at that. Wow. Y'all cannot be fucking. Y'all cannot tell me you've not wanted to RKO this child. Like, don't you want to RKO this child? What, what, what was John Cena's uh, attitude adjustment? This little, this little, this little dummy. Come on. And by the creators of cuties, here is another amazing. Misunderstood. Little engine act could work for y'all. Give uh, me a beat. Why are you talking like that, bitch? Guys, no, no guys. Don't do it, guys, don't no, do it, please. Do guys, I, guys, I, I can't. I'm gonna oh. introduce to you the biggest, baddest F word in this house right now. Let me hear you scream. She's making smaller shots. <laughs> Am I just really drunk or is this actually like okay? Is this actually good? What the fuck? Hey, it's so good of her to have such a big belly so it aligns up with her tits so the t-shirt so you can so you can tell it's happening the t-shirt. I'm pretty sure that she's the reason everyone hates the new Star Wars but a badass lady if you want to cover that for sure. Oof. Is it just me or was 2015 like peak sassy pop feminism video time? Can you be a real Star Wars fan if you're a woman? Is Hoth cold? Is Darth Vader Luke's dad? Can you blow up the Death Star with two shots of the exhaust port? I know so many facts about Star Wars. Look at all the facts I know about Star Wars. I'm a girl. Just pretty nice boobs. Why wouldn't I love an epic space opera that chronicles the existential crisis that cripples a young man when he finds out his father is the enemy he's been fighting all along? We get it. This is like the worst one you guys sent me. What is this? You don't look like a Star Wars fan. Yes, you do, actually. <laughs> when I get drunk, I turn into a stereotypical anti-feminist channel. What are you, triggered? Go back to your safe space, snowflake! Did your boyfriend get you into Star Wars? He did, though, actually. <laughs> Way. Just because I have a makeup collection that could rival Queen Amidala's doesn't mean I can't be a Star Wars nerd. I wear makeup and I like. Then why the fuck are you using that awful uh, lip cl color, bitch? The fuck? Uh, obviously, having a huge makeup collection doesn't mean you can actually 
apply makeup correctly, it seems. Yikers. I wear makeup and I like Star Wars. Don't hit on me, silly boys. Pretty. 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 What the fuck? Yes. This is how I want to go. This is how I want to die. Here lies Shoe on Head. She died doing what she loved. Cringing. Hey, inequality. Women are paid 23% less than men for the exact same fucking thing. Bitch, isn't that illegal? Isn't this illegal? Men for the exact same fucking work. Uh, we got no. I should have need a penis to get paid. This girl sounds drunker than me. I should have a penis to get paid. Rape and violence. Fucked up fact. One out of every five women. Will Yo, why the fuck they got these little kids cursing and shit? I can curse. I'm an adult. Sometimes. Yo, little bitch asses. Shut the fuck up and stop cursing. Where y'all parents at? Jesus Christ. Be sexually assaulted or raped Don't worry, no one's gonna concept. sexually assault you. Oh, nice. yes. Was <laughs> I didn't know be okay, I was uncalled for. I apologize. I don't really. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, they can count to five. This is actually fucking awful. Why would they tell a child this? They didn't even mention it comes from like a college campus survey or all the details involved or anything is just like oh one in five do these kids now believe that one of them is going to be raped this actually angers me get me in contact with fucky where are they located i just want to talk can i speak to the manager okay guys that was that i hope you had fun uh watching me die slowly i hope you got some yes enjoyment it was enjoyable absolute pain and misery yes. i will see you all next week with another video and i will be so yeah, she got wasted a little bit on the end. Don't worry, don't worry, it's okay, it's okay. Well, I enjoyed this. Let me know what y'all think about uh, men spreading pink tags, membranes falling out of women, uh, choke slamming little kids. Uh, let me know. Oh, yeah, patrons, patrons. I almost forgot. Let me think the patrons real quick. Pedro Martinez, Commands, Call You, and Rob Bear, Princess, Wastatic, Fewish, Chicken, 53. Thank y'all. And I'll uh, see you next time, everybody. Have a nice fucking day.